This is the plaintiff, Legacy P. Morpher. It says that their cousin, Lightning P. Morpher, is a cheap imitation and is damaging the goodwill that it created years ago when Bandai owned the rights to Power Rangers. It's suing for damages in the amount of $828.93. This is the defendant, Lightning P. Morpher. It says that it doesn't care about goodwill created by its cousin. Power Rangers is owned by Hasbro now, and it wants to do its own thing. Cut corners, and maybe save a little money too. It's accused of turning off the power. Raise your right hand. Order! Order in the court! Habeas Corpus, Corpus Christi, order in the court. Hey, Lemon the Toy Temple. Jury Fury, thank you so much for appearing. Let's get down to business. Mr. Lightning, you are charged with not being as good as the Legacy version. How do you plead? Not guilty. And might I add that Legacy actually said that you look terrible in that hat. That's not true, Your Honor, it's not. <laughs> We are not here to discuss my poor fashion choices. Get back to the case. Objection. Both of you. Okay, so in my younger days, I was a show prop. I was on screen with ranger legends like Tommy and Jason. Now I look in stores and see this thing clogging up the shelves in the clearance aisle. It just makes us all look bad. Well, if it wasn't for you I... coming out so recently, maybe I would have sold more. <laughs> Order! Order! This is a courtroom, and I will have order. With all due respect, my toy was considered a modest purchase for adult collector's lines, and even brought new eyes to the brand. Furthermore- New kinds of muscles, I too. Did you see their action figure line, Your Honor? At least we made the helmets the right shape. The helmets don't have muscles! Order! This is getting out of hand. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to review the Lightning Morpher. Maybe bring up some points about Legacy to compare and go from there. I feel like that's the fair and just thing to do. Do you get me? Yes, yes sure. Your Honor. Good. Now, let's take a look at that box. So taking a look at the package, it's a much larger box than the Legacy. Much larger. And I think that has a lot to do with the stand that it comes with. Up here at the top, you can get a pretty good look at that lightning morpher and, uh, you know, the five interchangeable coins displays them really nicely, but, uh, yeah, it gives you a good look. And this one isn't based off of, you know, any kind of prop. This is based off the original from 1993. Yeah. Lightning collection there at the bottom says power morpher. We've got the art of all the five original Rangers. Let's crack it open. And I hope you'll join me. Lightning collection has five colors, and it glows differently for each coin. Black, pink, blue, yellow, and red. Legacy, though, only has one set of lights, no matter what coin you use. First point goes to lightning. One to nothing. Hmm. Next up, let's take a listen to some of those sounds included with each morpher. The Legacy Morpher does include a couple sound effects, one of which is the communicator and the theme song for the show. And that's about it. There's a couple little explosion noises, but this is it. The Lightning has many, many sound effects, almost too many. They include explosion noises, Alpha, and all five original Rangers. Some voices aren't especially clear, like take the T-Rex one, for example. But the others are nicely done. I don't care for the voice effects mixed with the sound effects. I wish it was either just voice effects and sound effects. So with that said, it's a tough call, but I'm going to have to give it to Legacy on this one. Simpler is better. All tied up now. Now for the overall design, unfortunately, the lightning collection morpher doesn't have an on off switch, so it's constantly on. Batteries are not included. So me, being 250 IQ, started this review without actually buying any batteries. So I had to wait and wait, and I actually had to go to a gas station to pick some up, which was super frustrating. Could have just taken them from the remote downstairs. And then to top that off, it takes three AAA batteries, three. 
Why would they design it with such beefy batteries? In the Legacy, six years on, they still work just fine. Legacy is very heavy, but it displays very well because it's made out of that die cast. This is much more of a toy, and this one's much more of a serious collector's item. I couldn't agree more! I do want to say that I very much appreciate the stand that came with the Lightning Collection. However, the coins don't lock into place, so if jostled, they will fall out, which is a huge bummer. Bummer! The bell holder included with the Legacy is kind of junk. It's pretty useless, so I never bothered using it. Useless! The Lightning Coins are shiny and I think match the show a little bit better than the Legacy. Legacy is much more weathered, much more battle damaged, and on the back, You've got the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers logo on the Legacy, and on the back of the Lightning, you've got the actual head and helmet of the original Ranger. The coins are held in differently for each Morpher. For Lightning, which is inspired by the Morphers from the original toy line, they're held in via tabs built onto the coins, which I think ruins how they look, but that is how the originals looked, but I don't have to like it. And like I said, the coins on the Legacy are much more weathered, and it actually brings out a lot more detail that you can check out as opposed to the lightning, which, you know, under these harsh lights, you kind of get some glare on these, and these, you can still tell it's a pterodactyl. So with that said, thank you so much- So who wins? Hmm? Yeah, who wins? We've been waiting on the verdict this whole time! Oh yeah, we're still doing the People's Court parody. Legacy, yes. You were so good that they actually used you on screen a few times, which is a huge accomplishment for a replica like you. But with that said, your time is over. It's not a matter of who came first. Lightning has to forge its own way, good or bad, in this crazy toy world of ours. Living in your shadow is only going to hurt the Lightning Collection. And who knows, someday, the Lightning Collection, it's probably gonna be someone's first Power Rangers toy. And that is honestly pretty cool. If I was a kid, I would have loved to have a toy like that. Maybe they're gonna do a Tommy version in the future. Uh, in any case, verdict for the defendant in the amount of four points out of five. Now, get out of my courtroom. So, with that, trial adjourned. Thank you so much for watching. Hit like, share, subscribe. Let me know down in the comments which one you prefer. Legacy, Lightning. I like Legacy more, obviously, but Lightning is still, still has its pros. I like a lot about it. I really do. So with that, check me out on Instagram and Twitter, both at the Toy Temple. And remember, you're never too old to enjoy the things you love.